Hi, I'm Jacob from North Rock Bikes. Today we're going to do a first ride check on a road bicycle. First thing that you want to do is make sure that the brake calipers are installed on the front of your fork. You want the wheel to be basically centered between the brake pads, which are located on each side of the wheel. Also want to make sure that your brake release is in the down or closed position. Once you've checked all those things, just want to spin the wheel and make sure that the brakes are stopping it. For the back brake, you want to follow the same procedure as the front. Make sure that your brake release is in the down position. Make sure that the wheel is not rubbing on the brake pads. And you'll also want to spin the wheel and make sure that it's stopping. The next thing that you'll want to check is that the quick release lever is on the left hand side of the bicycle. You also want to make sure that your tire is rotating in the correct direction. And then you want to check that the quick release is tight. Just loosen the lever, and retighten it. Should give you some resistance when you're closing it, and it should leave an indentation on your hand once it's closed. Follow the same process to make sure that the rear quick release is also properly secured. The next thing we want to check is that the bolts on our bicycle are properly secure. You want to make sure they're snug, but do not over tighten them. The bolts that you need to check on a road bike are the two bolts located on the face plate of your stem. These hold the handlebars into your stem. You also want to check the bolt on the top of your stem and the two bolts located on the side of your stem. The last bolt that you'll want to check is the seat binder bolt. This holds the seat post into the frame. The next thing we want to check is that the pedals are firmly screwed into the crank arm. Use an adjustable wrench to do this. You want to remember that the right side pedal tightens to the right, and the left side pedal tightens to the left, which is opposite of what you're used to. Next thing that we want to do is use a bicycle pump to make sure that the tires are properly inflated. The correct PSI of the tire is located on the sidewall. You may have to look closely, but it is there. The next thing that we want to check is that our reflectors are on the bicycle. You want your white reflector on the front facing forwards, the red reflector on the rear of the bike facing backwards. You also have reflectors located in the spokes at the front and the rear tires, and you have them located on the front and back of your pedals. We also want to check that the cables are in front of the stem. You want to make sure that they're nice smooth loops, that there's no binding occurring. Finally, you want to give your bike a roll, make sure that the brakes are engaging. Before your first ride, you also may want to see our videos on proper bike fit and how to shift and brake with the road bike. Always wear a helmet, read your owner's manual, and have a great ride.